A close-in weapon system, or CIWS in short, is a point-defense weapon system used to detect and destroy incoming short-range missiles and enemy aircraft that have breached the outer defenses. It is typically mounted shipboard in a naval capacity, and these devices are installed on nearly all classes of larger modern warships. CIWS are also used on land to protect military bases. In today's video, we give you the 10 close-in weapon systems today and we will rank them based on rate of fire. Rhine Metal Orlikon Millennium Gun Originated from Switzerland, the weapon is designed to be controlled by an external fire control system using either radar or electro-optical trackers. In an anti-surface role, the Millennium Gun is a fast and powerful effector, while in an anti-air role, the Millennium Gun can engage a large spectrum of air threats ranging from low-radar cross-section anti-ship missiles to fast-attack aircraft and helicopters. The Millennium Gun can also defeat challenging low, slow and small air threats posed by unmanned aerial vehicle. It can fire an effective range of up to 5,000 meters at 1,000 rounds per minute. Donnell 35mm Dual Purpose Gun The 35DPG is a close-in weapon system for warships built in South Africa and is currently in service in the Valor-class frigates of the South African Navy. Its primary role is to defend against attack by helicopters, fixed-wing aircraft and missiles. It also has a secondary role against surface vessels and shore targets both in symmetrical and asymmetrical warfare and also in law enforcement where accuracy is critical because collateral damage is unacceptable. The effective firing range is about 4,000 meters and the rate of fire from each barrel is 550. The Morocco CIWS is a Spanish Navy 12-barrel 20mm Ehrlichan gun mounted in two rows of six guns each. The system's primary purpose is defense against anti-ship missiles and other precision-guided weapons. However, it can also be employed against fixed or rotary-wing aircraft, ships and other small craft, coastal targets and floating mines. The range of the system is listed as 1.5 to 2 kilometers, however, the effective range is much shorter at 0.5 kilometers. The Sea Zenith Sea Zenith is a 4 barrel 25mm CIWS used by the Turkish Navy on their Mako 200 frigates. A single barrel automatic gun fires a rate of 800 rounds a minute. The Sea Zenith is a remote-controlled gun mount which has a distinctive lean-back Y-shape. The system's primary purpose is defense against anti-ship missiles and other precision-guided weapons. However, it can also be employed against fixed or rotary-wing aircraft, ships and other small craft, coastal targets and floating mines. AK-630 the AK-630 is a Soviet and Russian fully automatic naval close-in weapon system based on a 6-barrel 30mm rotary cannon. In 630, 6 means 6 barrels and 30 means 30mm. The system's primary purpose is defense against anti-ship missiles and other precision-guided weapons. However, it can also be employed against fixed or rotary wing aircraft, ships and other small craft, coastal targets and floating mines. Goalkeeper Goalkeeper is a Dutch close-in weapon system introduced in 1979. This is an autonomous and completely automatic weapon system for short-range defense of ships against highly maneuverable missiles, aircraft and fast maneuvering surface vessels. Once activated, the system automatically undertakes the entire air defense process from surveillance and detection to destruction, including the selection of the next priority target. Its effective range is up to 2,000 meters and has a rate of fire about 70 rounds per second or 4,200 rounds per minute. Phalanx The Phalanx CIWS, an American closing weapon system for defense against incoming threats such as small boats, surface torpedoes, anti-ship missiles and helicopters. Consisting of a radar-guided 20mm Vulcan cannon mounted on a swiveling base, the Phalanx has been used by the United States Navy and the naval forces of 15 other countries. 
The U.S. Navy deploys it on almost all class of surface combat ships today. Phalanx is a six-barreled gun able to fire an effective range of up to 1,500 meters and with a rate of fire about 70 rounds per minute or 4,500 rounds per minute. Type 730 or 1130 The Type 730 is a Chinese 7-barreled 30mm Gatling gun CIWS and is mounted in an enclosed automatic turret and directed by radar and electro-optical tracking systems. It is found in the Chinese aircraft carrier Liaoning. Though externally similar to the Dutch goalkeeper in appearance, it is thought to operate indigenous radar and optical systems. The new Type 1130 appears to be an evolution of Type 730. It is equipped with a new 11-barreled gun with an increased rate of fire. Reports said that it could fire a rate of 10,000 rounds per minute. Kortik or Kashtan the Kortik is a modern naval air defense gun missile system deployed by the Russian Navy. Its export version is known as Kashtan. It is found in the Russian aircraft carrier Admiral Kuznetsov, Kurov-class battlecruiser, Nustrashimi-class frigate, and the People's Liberation Army Navy destroyers and other modern designs. The system can be employed against fixed or rotary wing aircraft or even surface vessels such as fast attack boats or targets on shore. Kashtan has an effective firing range of up to 4,000 meters and a rate of fire between 9,000 to 10,000. Panzer M Panzer M is a Russian jamming-resistant naval anti-air gun or missile system which entered service in 2018. Russia's sole aircraft carrier is getting upgraded with Panzer M close-in weapon systems. The Admiral Kuznetsov is currently getting repaired and overhauled following a fire that erupted one year ago. Panzer M is equipped with a friend or foe identification system and armed with naval version of the Panzer missiles and Hermes K missiles. Its secondary armament is two six-barreled rotary cannons. Same as on the Kashtan M, Panzer M is fully automated and can engage up to four targets simultaneously at a range of up to 20 kilometers and can operate as a battery of up to four modules. Panzer M can intercept sea skimming missiles flying as low as two meters above the surface. If a target isn't sufficiently destroyed by Panzer's missiles attack, it can automatically direct its cannons against it. According to experts, Panzer M's destructive power is three to four times higher than Kashtan M's variant. And with that, the buzz is signing off for today. But if you've enjoyed the video, don't forget to share and hit that like and subscribe button so we can continue making video for you guys. Thank you guys for viewing in. Bye-bye.